Hi, uh, my name is Brandon Swafford and I'm the CTO for User Data Protection at Forcepoint. And I get a lot of questions about how to think about deploying DLP and what it might do for your enterprise. And I think it's interesting because people view DLP as this, this control that can do so many things. And, and, and it can exist on your endpoint, at your web portal, and on your cloud solutions. But one thing to remember about DLP is that it's really meant to be educational in nature. And that is, it does serve to provide good protection and prevent accidental data loss. But one of the goals of it is to better educate your population so that as you start to have those events occur, you can use that information not just for security, but to push that back to training and rules and policy development because it's a beautiful source of information about how your employees are actually leveraging information and using all the services you provide for them.